Critical update for Bitcoin. This is London with Crypto Kingdom and Bitcoin Spike. We're going to talk about the price action of Bitcoin. Descending triangle across the top led to this pour down. Guys, very important. Please go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe, and share the video. Former financial professional, but not financial advice. Harvard Business School, Duke University, etc. Certified in markets. Let's get into the details real quickly now. Currently, the price is at 39000 straight at about, at about 39000 You understand that we have this inverse head and shoulder. Guys, we call that in a live stream if you guys don't have the notifications on you're going to miss our next live stream the inverse head and shoulder as measured on the actual candle wicks was the uh, amplitude essentially the carry up amplitude just very nicely measured to this first hit once we got to the top just to explain the price action in terms of what went on we went through a small reversal which conquered this rising wedge was it actually a rising wedge in this zone pardon me had to remind myself here but this rising wedge actually got beaten by this fan reversal very common pattern thereafter we tried to traject up through a very interesting cross trend line please pay attention to this very very interesting let me move this up just a touch here let's get into the cross trend line at this four hourly this resistance right in here guys this cross trend line resistance to support to resistance to support to resistance this line here essentially was the call off feature for the bulls where the bears stepped in and at around that 42,700 so that's been a very very uh, solidly solidly excuse me reinforced line in the market and uh, let's dig back down into the lower time frames after i show you essentially this elliptical formation that you're seeing on the four hourly which i definitely believe guys you have one two three four five pivots along this elliptical and yes it is it is mitigating the expectations of the traders right now it's just very very prominently featured if you trade bitcoin a lot you will understand that yes bitcoin likes to round quite a bit it likes to go through that rounding feature okay so that is uh nothing new to us here i also want to talk about these uh triangles why do i have these triangles here let's discuss that real quickly you understand that the first ascending triangle here you'll remind yourselves guys we discussed that ascending triangle and the likelihood while we're, we were up and above that ascending triangle that we would return at least to that previous uh previous let's say uh top line resistance at least to this top line resistance and we did okay this secondary this secondary ascending triangle and again guys it's going to have a flat top resistance it's going to have an ascending line of support right so that flat top resistance i gave you a warning here a direct warning okay a video saying warning we may return here now that was the second one so first ascending triangle return second ascending triangle return the third ascending triangle was hidden within that that inverse head and shoulders i streamed on this last night to get through the details let's go to the hourly time frame very easily seen on the hourly time frame and let's just take a look at this in terms of that flat top resistance ascending line of support and yes guys we have returned for a third time if you're not uh, noticing a pattern guys you should the ascending triangles like to return to at least this top line resistance so very consistent trades a nice pour down for anyone who has uh, decided to trade this bearish pattern and the expectation of the return to at least this top line resistance you're got, you're off uh, about seven percent right now to about that 39,000. in terms of the pickup features i will note that we are currently consolidating you guys understand that we're currently consolidating with a positively sloping Okay, buyers are stepping in a positively sloping line of support. That positively sloping line of support provides the expectation in line with a macro. Let's just do this in line with a macro, uh, a macro rising, rising or ascending. We'll say ascending triangle would be the best technical description. The ascending triangle, cutting away these two features here makes it a bit more solid. Okay, we're going to be looking and watching the price action very carefully. The reason why is the following: A, we need to pick up at an ascending line of support. We need to maintain this as an ascending line of support. Buyers need to continue to step in. There is a slight issue. Please pay attention. There's a slight issue with the fact that we have underperformed. If you guys will please pay attention. We have underperformed recently here at that cross trend line, which I went over. 
which you guys are aware of. Okay, we've underperformed at this specific cross trend line. Resistance to support, resistance, resistance to resistance again. Okay, go to the candle wicks. Maybe a little bit variable in here. But given the fact that we just just underperformed here the expectation would have been that we would have been able to get to this line of resistance this flat top resistance so the buyers are expressing a bit of weakness right now a little bit of a surprise uh, level of weakness we weren't surprised to return to preceding this preceding level of resistance the flat top on the ascending triangle in the vip in fact in the back we actually caught the descending triangle right as it was pouring down if you guys are not a member of the crypto kingdom yet i want you guys to join you can do it from a desktop computer hit join our vip got that signal very important so we look forward to bringing you guys additional technicals right now buyers need to step in we're looking for a pattern what is the old adage guys it's buy it support sell it resistance trade your patterns right this would be a resistance here trade your patterns a pattern right here and um, buying a support would be right here and we also want you guys to hit your targets those fibonacci's are key right now as we watch the specific interaction on the different time frames let's say with that also that 200 and 100 um that 100 would be an orange the 200 and purple moving average so this is london with crypto kingdom we will be streaming later just wanted to bring everyone kind of a relaxed technical update as you guys get ready for the uh, weekend, we've got another day here of trading, full day, uh, about two days of, of trading, really, but we're going to be getting ready for that weekend. Hope you guys are ready for some streams, and we'll get ready for some additional price action. It's been incredible in terms of the ability to trade. This range has been really nice, all tucked up against, and do beware of this lower, I'd say the lower threshold at that 50% retracement, that 50% discount. As you guys know that the 50% discount is a crucial level. It's been hit multiple times. I don't want you to be uh, caught off guard if indeed we hit this this 50% retracement again, about that 34,500, just a 50% discount from that all-time high of 69,000. So we like, again, guys, buyers to pick up strongly, and we need to, step A, we need to get over this specific cross trend line. And then we have a second hurdle now. We have a, a uh, top line resistance in addition to that cross trend line. So for those of you who are trading, I know the VIPR, shout out to Angel as well. Top VIP, 60, uh, no, about $58,000 in overall contributions invested in Bitcoin since $7.79. He's the kind of the king of the VIPs. If you guys would like to join us, don't be intimidated. We just require blue collar or white collar that you want to beat the market. That's the most important thing. Guys, hope you're having a great day. This is London with Crypto Kingdom and Bitcoin Spike.